I'm like, ATMs, wait, I get to buy something one time for four figures and I get to have it for the rest of my life and it'll always be bringing in passive income. Initially, if I had that $50 and didn't buy the mortgage note and I put that into ATMs, I would have been making five, six, seven times what I was making with the mortgage note just from ATMs. Good evening, everyone. This is Andrea coming to you from ATM Together with another phenomenal testimony from one of our newest clients out of Atlanta, Georgia. Charity, are you there? I am. Thank you for joining me tonight. Tell me a little bit about yourself. I'm 32. I used to be in technology, but now I'm a full-time entrepreneur. Yeah, that's about it. A full-time entrepreneur. So tell me about some of your other endeavors. I also do uh, like travel tours as well as Airbnb um, and as well as Toro. So there's a couple things that are in there. And I'm also writing a children's book. As a full-time entrepreneur, what does passive income mean to you and how does it factor in your lifestyle? To me, it means freedom because I travel full time. Like I literally have my son, I'm a single mom, mind you. And you know, it's not like I came from a rich family. I've pretty much done everything on my own. I've worked really, really hard in my life. And um, we kind of just got tired of working so much. You know, my son was in school, I was working so much and I never got to spend time with my son. So I took, you know, a leap of faith and just I quit my job and started full-time you know being an entrepreneur and although it has been difficult because in the beginning I didn't have mentorship I didn't have a group of people helping me along the way like it was a struggle now it moved at such a slower pace but now that I have a team of people helping me and moving forward and I'm able to see like I've been with ATM together for three months um, and it's just been really awesome the entire time. Anytime I got anxiety or, you know, I had a question, I got everything answered within 24 hours and that was amazing. I didn't think that would happen, but I knew that if I had a question, I would get an answer very quickly. You literally give me goosebumps. As a single mom, you took a whole leap of faith and left corporate America to pursue your dreams. How was that process for you going into business with a team of people who definitely had your back, but for the most part, we're strangers to you. How is that for you? It still felt amazing because no matter where I was, I still had access to them. All I needed, you know, was my phone or my laptop and I was able to reach out. Like just last night I had a question and I'm actually done deploying my ATM. Right. And I reached out and said, hey, I'm on location. I have a situation. What do I do? And I got an immediate answer within five minutes. And that was after everything was already deployed. And it's just been amazing, to be honest. Like, I've been an entrepreneur for maybe three years. And that first two years was very, very difficult. Like, it wasn't easy. Like, I was making wrong moves left and right, losing money. Like you know, wasting time. And it was nice to say, I just found out about this just a couple of months ago and I'm already making money from it today. Like right. none, none has done that for me. ATMs are a lot different from Airbnb. It's a world away from travel tours. Um, what about this industry piqued your interest? The passive income part. I don't care what industry <laughs> I'm in, as long as it's passive income. I think a lot like, of, show me the money. <laughs> I think a lot of people sleep on the idea of passive income because it, it could take a long time to acquire and cost a little bit more to start up. Yeah. Um, however, even if it's only $100 a month or $500 a month, it's still money that you don't have to work for and it's very freeing up your time so that you can do what you want to do. Right. So a lot of people are like, oh, it's only making this much or it's only making that much. And I'm just like, but I don't have to work for it. You work for every penny that you're making. Like if you don't show up, you don't get paid. I don't have to show up. Any <laughs> Very true. How was the engagement with the actual ATM itself? Like the programming and all those things. How was that? 
Um, it actually was really easy. Honestly, my son did it. I read the directions and he pressed all the buttons. Anytime I can get him involved in my projects, I do. So even if it's just me sitting there reading him directions, that's literally all he did. And even as I was reading directions, he started picking up and moving faster than me. I was like, slow down, make sure you're pressing the right button. But right. he did. I didn't, I don't think I touched one button. He did the whole thing. And he's 12. ATMtogether.com has been good for you. Mm -hmm. Who would you tell about it? I have honestly already been telling people about it. Like I spoke to someone today about it. They were like, is there anything I can invest in? I was like, absolutely. I have a few things for you. And right. I about this because I was just like, this like passive income is just like you said, a no brainer. And like, I plan to get a lot more. my goal is to have 20. So <laughs> I'm going to get funding and go big. <laughs> Listen, go big or go home. But at some point, there's going to be someone on the other side of this stream watching this video. They're going to be a little skeptic. They're like, oh, they paid her. She's just saying this. Um, you know, she's a model. You, whatever they come up with. What advice or what real information can you tell someone on the other side of the screen that would put them over the fence or just tell me a little bit about your experience that made you pull a trigger? Honestly, from the beginning, it was just a no brainer. I just pulled the trigger off of knowing that it was something. So I started in real estate and with real estate, I had to with mortgage notes and I had to pay all this money up front, maybe like $50,000 to make I think I was making on one mortgage note uh, $850 a month, which is fine. But I'm like, ATMs, wait, I get to own this? for, And that was only a, something that I would have owned for four years. Right. And then I for the note. So after doing that, seeing ATMs where I'm like, wait, I get to buy something one time for four figures and I get to have it for the rest of my life and it'll always be bringing in passive income. And I can, if I did that, if I, initially if I had that $50 and didn't buy the mortgage note and I put that into ATMs, I would have been making five, six, seven times what I was making with the mortgage note just from ATMs. So then it was a no brainer for me after having that comparison with my initial investment. And I've already lost that investment because it ended after four years. Right. So have to ever lose my ATM investment. Like I'm going to own that the rest of my life. You just keep hitting us with the jewels, <laughs> you know? All right, Charity. Thank you so much again. Have a good evening. You do the same. All right.